Hey, welcome to the Dad Club. I'm Ben Stumpf. This is Nick Fabiano. Hi. And with us is our guest and host, Paul. I'm going to let you say your own last Costable. Name. Hey, guys. Costable. I thought it was Costable. It's Costable. Yeah. You know, I'm going through this right now in my career, but this is great to be here. I, yeah. I've wanted to be in like a dad club for a long time oh, as a do. dad. Yep. So it's nice to finally actually wear that and, and have the title, you know? Mm-hmm. What was growing up like in your house? Growing up suburban... Uh, uh, Italian Catholic. My mom's a little Irish. We're all, my fa- other side of the family is from Italy, so very classic Jersey mix. Like mm-hmm. yeah. hair gel, pasta dinners, lots of music. All my my dad's a musician. All music. I used, and, and I was in bands growing up. Like I played yeah. drums. The first band was all Metallica. Nice. Right. Can't you tell? Yeah. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. Let's go. Yeah. So I was always a drummer, but now I like play a little piano, guitar, and stuff. Oh, nice. Yeah. Just because yeah. my wife's a professional artist, and so like I want to get so good that I could like you know cut a record with her label. That's there basically you go. like this the slow game with the marriage is like getting yeah, yeah. a record deal for me. Yeah. Which is awkward in the home because she's Do you guys like jam out on like we Sundays? Do, we do actually. Yeah. We legitimately like sit down and jam as a family. It's been really fun. That's awesome. The baby, and the baby's the baby. kicking it in. Yeah. yeah, yeah. We're like yeah. forcing it. She could be anything she wants in life. We're gonna support her or whatever she wants, sure. but literally we're like hammering but, in but music. She has to be a musician. She, she sits has at the, to be a singer. Yeah. We're yeah, yeah she has to be. And we do lessons <laughs> every morning at six AM. She's out of the crib. Let's go. E flat. Yeah. Let me hear it. Yeah. Yeah. Do yep. it. Beautiful. Good. You're a little sharp, but it's all right. It's early. Get, get some on. milk. Yeah. Nice. Uh, yeah, but, milk uh, is usually good for the it's, vocal yeah, it's cords. Perfect. <laughs> that's how my that's how the professional singers warm up. It's cheese yeah, and milk. Yeah. Italian. Chug a warm glass of milk. <laughs> um but no, it's been really fun. We have a drum set in the living room. Nice. So our house is always, and we, we just got this music set up around the house. So like if we're not playing music physically, we're like putting on tunes mm-hmm. around. I don't know. That's yeah. sort of how I grew up. That's how I like living. Before. When I was single, I always had music. It's just like yeah. how I, yeah. I kind of see life musically a lot of times. I'm in a great mood. Like I'm thinking of what song goes with yeah. the, the moment. Yeah, I really, really am. Because yeah, I've been around music my whole life. Your kid's young, but do you have like a set? day of the week or something like that where you can kind of go out you and your wife kind of go out we just yes we it's always hard in a marriage early on with the baby like yeah. where's the time oh, yeah. for that my, yeah. my tip that I've learned I could tell I don't know if I really should give advice but okay. finding the silly finding the way to play oh, yeah. with each other like not mm-hmm. the best terminology but you know what I mean like <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Christina and I actually just went and got tattoos together which we've actually never done mm. and that was like a nice like oh man we're crazy yeah. crazy parents <laughs> getting tattoos the baby's home like yeah. this is my excitement level now yeah, but it yeah. was awesome it was a yeah. fun night so. what did you get? Uh, I did Mike Tyson's face on my left butt cheek oh nice but yeah. with his face tattoo right off the oh, wall great so yeah. like you see yeah, he's got the it's like a reverse thing. Yeah, yeah 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 that's great no, no, yeah no. um I got, I got a little thing of the Chrysler building, actually. And what did she get? She uh, just turned 33, so she got a Disney 33 club thing. Oh, okay. nice. Which is the club of... But she's not in the club. You have to, like, pay a crazy amount of money to be in it. Oh, I, I don't so know she, anything about but this club. The low, just send a like picture this, like, of the tattoo now. Yes. Maybe she can get in. She's getting closer, and she got... She Maybe she'll do it eventually, but she got, like, the 33 logo of that. She just turned 33, mm-hmm. and then she got little Mickey ears in her ear. Oh, no way. So, yeah. That's she got cute. a lot of tattoos. She's used to it. Me, it's only my second one. So oh, she, right. She so. was a Disney kid, I would assume. She's a Disney woman. Oh, Disney yeah. person. Disney yeah. person. And do now you, we are a Disney family. I was going to say, you oh, yeah. kind of find yourself doing that with your kid. For even sure. Though, even though they're only sure. a year and a half old. Oh, yeah. We've already been with her. Like She didn't even know where she was. She oh, was, yeah, like, yeah. an infant. And we're like, we're going on rides. Yeah. Because we love it. Obviously, you go to Disney World, right? Not Disneyland. Completely incorrect. We go to Disneyland. Oh, you did it wrong. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. You're an East Coast person. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's the original. We're old school okay. people. We like that Walt walked around there. That's one thing. Right. We also go to L.A. sometimes, so it's nearby. All right. We are going to Disney World for New Year's Eve. Oh, mm. that's an event. Which is a, a new thing we've never done. Mm-hmm. But we do. We, we get to do both. And I don't want to be a guy sitting here in a soup being like, we go to Disney every week. But we get to, we get to go every once in a while. Yeah. Christina, my wife, has worked with them. We, we just pop in every every so often. And we love it. So we're going to the Orlando one because it's awesome too. It's so fun. What I love about there, getting back to like how you find time with your wife. Like if we take a day and go to Disneyland... Yeah. We're going to be kids and play together and be like have so much. It's like That's the right. happiest place ever. Mm-hmm. Right. You can't get in a fight with your wife at Disneyland. I mean, you can. Oh, I bet I can. But it's a lot. Yeah, you can. Probably, yeah. Look, you can, but it's a, it's at least a little bit harder. <laughs> like it's a little bit harder to like get there. Like, so you got to get those fast pass though. Yeah, if you don't get those, yeah. you're going to plenty oh, yeah, of fights. If you're online for two hours, then yeah, you're going to be yeah. sweating. And yeah, you know, <laughs> yeah, depends on how you do it. You have like 
bunch of group friends that are dads, or are you like the first one? Uh, no, I have a, a, a one buddy who has two kids. He was the first, and he okay. got married a little bit younger. Mm-hmm. So we have some dad chats every once in a while, and yeah. then actually a couple friends of friends and stuff. And it's interesting once you become a dad. Some of my buddies, or or even some of my wife's friends, like. We have like bonding dad relationships now, dad mm-hmm. to dad. Yeah. I don't know what you guys oh, yeah. call it here. Oh yeah, dad on dad. Nah, dad to dad is better. Dad, than dad on dad, dad, on dad yeah. can be a little tricky, but uh, especially daddy on dad. We're open to anything. That's a very different. Thing. Whenever yeah. I have a cigar, my father in law, I always say, "Daddy on daddy cigars." <laughs> um, don't, but, don't, don't do it. Yeah. Change that. Daddy so, on yeah, daddy. Yeah, he's he he doesn't he doesn't hear it. He's like, "That's oh, fine." Um, yeah. But yes, I'm starting to really, it's been such a cool like club, honestly, yeah. like where you can relate. Even some friends who I've never even had like real conversations with, almost like the surface, you're like, hey, how are you? How's work, right? Some new f- people have come into the mix and be like, dude, what's, does this happen to you guys? Yeah. Or, you know. It's a, literally a club. It feels when, like when a club, Once it yeah. happens, you're like, oh, now people I've never talked to, you yeah. can't, like a conversation starter and you get like a little bit of a bond. Yeah, yeah. Kind of even cool. even meeting you, it's like, yeah, you know, he's a dad. Yeah, yeah. You get it, you know. Yeah, and, you get it, yeah. And uh, you know, there's a relata- and, relatability yeah. there to, to all the, the hard things with it and then all the great things. And yeah. Kind of, I've kind of picked up friendships in many ways. And what's mm-hmm. fun is in our little town now, um, like our neighbor's about to have a baby and there's a lot of like people mm-hmm. in my age group starting to do this too. Yeah. So it's constantly like a fun thing to share with everybody. I will say though, I've, I, someone gave me the best advice becoming a dad and I've been sharing this with everybody, sure. which is like, don't give advice. And I oh, literally yeah, say yeah, it to yeah, everybody yeah. because then That's advice. Like, do your own thing. It is, you're right. Technically <laughs> it's advice. That, he's right. If I can give you one piece of advice. <laughs> don't. Don't give advice. Which is my advice. Uh, <laughs> But, but but basically, you know, you figure out your own thing too. Because the, the challenge when you're new to becoming a parent is yeah. everyone, especially old school Italian family, like everyone's going to tell you how to oh. do it. A lot of people mean well in families too, but it, you learn once you make your own. Like mm-hmm. you take what you want, you do your own thing. Yep. Um, you just got to go, yeah. Yeah, 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 cool. yeah. Oh, yeah. You got to practice your like, your diplomatic. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, oh, cool. Right. Thanks. Yeah, I'll take oh, that into consideration. Oh, yeah. Or like the more. Oh, oh, you're just learning it. My, oh, I didn't hear about oh, that. Oh, right. Oh, cool. Yeah, I know yeah. for sure we're not going to do that, but thank you. It's <laughs> great. It's great. We've already, oh, the kid's way older than that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, so we're past that. Yeah, right, yeah. right, right. No, no, no. The, the baby's walking. It's been, <laughs> she's 11. <laughs> my like, favorite is when non parents are like, oh, my, my kid wouldn't do that. Like, I wouldn't have a kid that did that. Yeah. This. And look, this is not because you're not a parent, but yeah. this is what happens when you have friends who don't have kids, and, and you know this. Oh yeah. Y- you'll never know until you have them. We're not being—I'm not being self-righteous. You just never know what it's actually like. And some of my—it does change. Some of my buddies who don't have it try to talk to me sometimes. Yeah. yeah. And I'm just like, they—they they don't get it, and you could you just see you see their eyes glaze over, and yeah. they see, you can see the back of the head. They're like, I just—I don't know what you're talking. About. Yeah. Right. Until yeah. they know. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So no. that happens too a little bit. But that's okay. Everyone's great. And yeah. You don't know how you are as a dad until you become one either. Like, yeah. I still you can have know. this whole idea of like, I'm going to be like this. You know, I'm going to make it like so we get all the, the certain toys from a certain place. And, but yeah. the kid wants their own stuff. Get the, get whatever the kid wants. Make them happy. Yeah. You and know? the kid's yeah. a total wild card. I mean, yeah, you, have, you never know. You got two kids and they're entirely different from each other. Right? Yeah. I mean, and they swapped personalities kind of. Like my <laughs> older one was like a wild, crazy kid. Yeah. He was like one or two. Turned three years old, became a princess. Insane. And she's been that nice. way. She just turned five. The other one was like, oh, our Zen baby. Oh, she's going to, you know, she's the opposite. Yeah, right, the amount right. of Instagram posts that were like, our perfect Zen baby. And then it's Zen. like completely like, whoa, whoa, that's not how it's happening. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Holy crap. You know, but they, they it change. makes it interesting though. Yeah, they change all the time. Yeah. And, and the thing about pre-dad too is like I used to be that guy that was like, oh, no, no, my kids are never going to do that. Right. And then the second you have a child, you're like, yeah, we're doing that. Yeah. yeah, we're yeah. going to do that thing. It, yeah, just, yeah, yeah. it just changes it all. Oh, yeah. So you have a new podcast. What's yes. that about? It's called The Pop-Up Show. It's daily, which is a crazy ambitious thing. And it's cold calls from strangers. I call some people all over the world. Nice. Old timers I call and get advice from old people, which I love. Do they and like to be called old timers? I call them out on the show after we record it. <laughs> okay. So I don't really know. Maybe. <laughs> Try it out. Try it out. I've been See saying that. I, I say people from yesteryear sometimes. Mm-hmm. I say that oh, okay. too. The forgotten people? The, yeah, yeah, yeah. The people, you know, the one person in the party no one's talking to. <laughs> Those guys I call, we get advice, and then also just like news of the day. We pop in real quick, 20 minutes a day, give you something to talk about and learn, and then we get out of your way. Nice. It's called The Pop-Up Show. Called The Pop-Up Show. All Check right. out The Pop-Up Show. Where can they find it? Uh, Apple and Spotify. Nice. On podcast. The Pop-Up Show. All right. Show, the yeah. Pop-Up Show starring Paul Costable. 
Wow. Costable. Can I can I use your audio for my intro? Actually, oh, yeah, you say yeah, it one yeah. more time for I can use it for the podcast. The pop up show with Paul Costable. Yeah, I'm gonna use that. 100. Yeah, Thank you. Yeah, if you yeah, don't yeah. mind. Yeah. No, I, I'll give you I a... would appreciate it. Yeah. Okay, good. The pop up show with Paulie C. Yeah, we're gonna use his. Yeah, yeah it's fine. Cool.